record this air conditioning truck. Got all the parts, the pump, rad support. Battery box is toast. And that can be fixed. Demon 60. Uh, yeah, it's got the normal rust, but it's got all its trim. All its 76. Glorious 76 trim. Doors are shut. XLD. Nice. Ford Ranger LT. Excuse me. XLT. It's old split rims. are changed. Probably the first time those wheels have been changed in 20 years. If I go by the plate, last time it was insured was in May of 93. Oh, look how thick those stickers are. <laughs> so, not the best tires and rims, but Better than split rims. Much better than split rims. XLT F250. This is a 1974 model. Still got all its chrome. I got two bits of chrome in the back. Tailgate still got all its chrome. All the chrome is still here for this. But it is an air conditioned truck, so that's neat. You could smell. This is intense. Wow. Oh, something was living in here. No. Wonder if it's still living in there. Feels pretty heavy. Oh, locked. Must be a handgun in there.
getting late. That's all it is for today. First day, getting it home. Turns out it's a 74. 73, 12, 73. So, registered as a 74. That's a wrap for episode one and partial introduction. Might do a walk around before I actually use this video. I don't know. We'll see how this one comes together. But couldn't pass it up. Diamond in the rough. But lots of life left in it. this uh, skid steer I mean hydraulic pressure line seems to have let go flat spot worn out there this line goes from the uh, main pump off the head up to the uh, actual valve to control the bucket arms everything else but that's not even the hardest part <sighs> The hardest part right now is trying to get the secondary drive pump high pressure line to the motor off. It is blown right out. Freaking oil everywhere. <clears throat> Thomas skid steer 133. Yeah, old Thomas 133. Um, this is what a blown high pressure hose looks like.